Wait, Mark. So, t tell me more about like that one dude, that guy that you said is like up to his ears in debt. <laughs> what was it like, like thirty-seven thousand or something? Like holy shit. Thirty-seven G's at thirty-one years old, man. He's what? like, Mark, yeah, he hit me up on the phone. He's like, dude, I'm I'm up to debt in my e I'm up to debt in my ears. Up to ears of my debt, or however he said it. <laughs> and I started laughing at him. He's like, what what's going on? I was like, dude, listen. The problem is you don't know how to make money. That's the real problem. Secondly, thirty-seven thousand dollars is not a lot of money at all. You gotta learn how to make money. Not only that, your thirty-seven thousand dollars in debt is all bullshit junk stuff that you buy. See, when my me and my buddies are buying stuff with debt. We're buying assets that produce revenue. I know guys that have four, five hundred, eight hundred million dollars in debt. But the thing is, is they're producing millions of dollars a month in revenue. Jeez. See, it's a difference. It's understanding how to manage debt, how to manage flow, how to get out of your own way. Not only that, you're 31 years old, dude. You got to figure this out. The truth is, most people never figure it out. But 37 grand in debt's nothing. The good news is, is you can get this paid off real quick with a couple deals down the street, make some money, build a business or whatever, and start chipping away at that debt. But you gotta start thinking about debt in a better way. You gotta look at debt, you gotta reverse engineer the debt conversation with yourself and understand how it really works. Debt can serve you actually, um, instead of hurt you. And most most people actually are being hurt by debt. Not because, it, I, I know a lot of people have debt, but like bad debt is bad debt, good debt is good debt. You just gotta know. Turn your liabilities into assets. How do you use your debt to buy an asset to produce cash flow? That's really what you're really asking. You're not up to debt and like you're one deal away from being debt free if that's the case. <laughs> but oh, but man. the problem is if you don't learn the trick I'm sharing with you about good debt and bad debt, you're gonna be right back in the same position, probably worse off position, because you're older and now you know better. Don't make the bad decisions. You got this.